Darren, looking back at the game as a whole, is there maybe a bit of frustration that we haven't come away with all three points today? Yeah, I think so. Um, considering how clinical we've been in the final third of late, uh, one or two just decision making wasn't wasn't great. We had a situation late on where Efron's broke and should have just squared it to Dunny and give Dunny a one v one with a keeper, but he chose to try and beat his man. So you know, decision making like that. Simeon's had a great, had an unbelievable save by the keeper. In all fairness, great ball in and. Um, but, you know, I'm not too disappointed. You come away from home and you've kept a, well, we've kept a clean sheet and we look quite solid defensively. I don't recall them ever really making Lochi work as such. He's had a little situation at the end that he snuffed out, snuffed out for him. Um, but other than that, I thought we was um, the side looking most likely, in all fairness. They, that, I felt they grew into the game in the second half, but... You know, what we've been doing well of late is counter-attacking well and looking a real threat in the final third, but we didn't just didn't have that cutting edge about us today. Well, you must be happy with, as you say, the way we defended, given that we had at the back, obviously we don't have Dan Sweeney available, Ricardo Santos is out, and the boys are performing brilliantly at the back. Well, when, you've, when, you, when you really sort of analyse it like that and you go, we've got one centre-half on the pitch and when Josh Walker goes off, we've got no centre-forwards on the pitch. Um, yet we're still looking looking a threat without being clinical today. So, yeah, there, there is pluses from getting a clean sheet. Obviously, all the shot have been in good form at home of late. So, you know, it, it, it's it's not it's funny how football turns around quickly, isn't it? I've got a change room full of disappointed players that we've we've only drawn the game, and 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 that's what we need going forward. We need to make sure when we're on the road, we pick something up, and. We, we get our wins at home and, you know, we're a long season to go still, but we, we won't be too far away. You mentioned the loss of Josh Walker there. Have you got any more information on what the knock was or how he's doing? Yeah, I think we're getting the, the, the ref checked out to, to make sure he's OK because why I didn't see it as a penalty, but he, he should be OK for his next fixture. Um, but Josh has just got a kick in the head. Um, and... We didn't even get a call now, let alone more than that. So, you know, he's all, hopefully he's OK, but, you know, we've we've had it with Efron of late with concussion rules and whatever. Hopefully he'll be OK for uh, New Year's Day. Obviously we've had Efron back in the squad today, got some minutes, and Dan Sparks got some minutes following, obviously, his suspension. It must be nice to get them back in the round squad. Yeah, it's nice to have <coughs> attacking options from the bench. It'd be nice once we get... Um, Shaq obviously back another another centre you've got to remember he's a 20 goal a season last year so he's been a loss for us so he's edging closer and, and, and obviously with our defenders um, I'm hoping that sooner rather than later you know they'll, they'll be available for us and, and it'll just all contribute to us having a, a, a stronger group of players to pick from Obviously a clean sheet away from home you must be happy with the form heading into what's going to be a big game on the Tuesday yeah, I'm not. Listen, I, I am a bit disappointed that we haven't won the game. Of course, I am. I wanted to keep the run going, but you know, I'm also happy enough with uh, ha- certainly how we've defended and how we've um, kept the clean sheet. But a little bit of frustration with, especially you know, I know these players inside out, but certainly with our recent form of how clinical we've been, um, to not score at the other end gives me a slight disappointment but I, I won't dwell on it because we look forward to Wednesday now and just finally Darren a mention for the fans who came out and support the team today listen always always appreciate it always like to mention it obviously you know good numbers followed us today got right behind the team clapping the boys at the end um, just really appreciate their support let's come out in numbers again on, on Wednesday get right behind the team and let's hope that um we can win the game and everyone go home happy on on New Year's Day but certainly today I appreciate your support thank you